Hey everybody, it's Remove here once again, and today, awesome unboxing video, you can see it, it's a PS4, and uh, pretty fucking excited about this, just got off work, and I'm pretty much gonna spend the whole night making, or uh, playing this uh, gaming console, cause it's gonna be fucking crazy. Um, just so you guys know, uh, I'm making this unboxing video the day the PS3 comes out, or the PS4 comes out, um, but I'm not gonna actually uh, upload this for a while after, because... Um, honestly, I'll be playing this, and I also have to go out of town, so, uh, it just kind of doesn't really work perfect for this, but, uh, you know, anyways, cool stuff, unboxing, uh, one thing I noticed right off the bat, um, I personally, as you can see, my consoles are vertical, my Xbox is the only thing I have here right now, but, uh, um, says, uh, well, right here is vertical, but you have to buy a vertical stand, apparently, it says vertical stand sold separately, so that's kind of a crapper right out of the bat, but, uh, I mean, that's how it was on the PS3, and, you know, it kind of turned out okay, so... Not not too big of a deal, um, but uh, pretty cool stuff. 500 gigabytes, um, black, you got that cool line across the... Uh, kind of near the middle. It's pretty cool. Um, the box, let's see what else is on here. Got some PlayStation tape, which is fucking sweet. Uh, yeah, I guess just um, some stuff on the back, PlayStation Plus. Of course, if you guys don't already know this, you have to have PlayStation Plus to play online on PS4. So, uh, pretty cool. Although, I think this comes with the trial, but, uh, we'll talk about that when we get inside there. And, uh, I think that's pretty much about it for the, for the, uh, box. But, let's get inside and see what it's all about. So, here we go. Um, yeah, a little... Might as well just start off the controller. I've already seen a couple unboxings of this, so... Everybody starts off with the controller, so I guess I will, too. We'll take it out of the, uh, plastic, of course. Um, yeah, so pretty cool. Take those off, I suppose. So, uh, yeah, it looks pretty cool. Um, well, that's weird. It's glossy on that. I never, never noticed that. But, uh, yeah, button, or the D-pad, basically the same. Button's pretty the same. Analog sticks are different. They have those little grips. And, uh, seems kind of interesting. PlayStation button is a little bit different. I never noticed that. And there's a the little speaker. I think it has. Touchpad. Um, I've heard different things about that. But, uh, pretty cool. Share button. Options. Triggers. There's, of course, that light bar right there, which is pretty cool. Plug-in thing. Uh, I think it has the same plug-in as the old controller, which is fucking awesome. Uh, beyond that, uh, there's some some other stuff. Plug-ins for, like, microphone and shit like that. Um, the controller, obviously, is different. Um, wow, you know, it feels... I mean, I don't really know if it is a lot lighter. I'll go get my other controller to compare it. Maybe it's not lighter, but it just... Maybe it isn't lighter, but it just feels lighter. And it, uh... I don't know, it just feels way different. Of course it looks different, but uh, it just feels totally different, uh, but it's fucking cool. It's, it feels really interesting. It feels like a morph of the PS3 controller and the uh, Xbox 360 controller. So, pretty cool. Um, what else do we got up here before we get to the console? Looks like we got... Uh, oh, okay. I'm not going to show you guys my codes because I'm probably going to use them myself, so sorry guys, but... Uh, <laughs> Let's see, you get a code for 30 days of PlayStation Plus, $10 on the PSN store, or, uh, and uh, 30 days of Music Unlimited, which is like their music service, which is actually pretty cool, by the way. Um, you got a quick start guide, which I uh, probably won't need. Uh, and there is the PS4 itself. Let's get it out of there. And uh, actually kind of weighs a lot, but it's pretty small. Obviously it looks small. But it kind of weighs more than you would think. Um, wow, it looks really cool, though. Corners are actually, like, really sharp. They're not actually, like... I don't know, it just seems kind of interesting. Uh, <laughs> I mean, like, the corners are, like, actually, like, sharp. They're not, like, uh, you know, it's all around. Oh, I guess I can put this down there. Um, you know, I, I've i always seen unboxings for this. That is where the power button is right there. People never show me that. Power button is up there. Eject button is down there. And uh, I know they are uh, touch-sensitive buttons, which is kind of cool. Also, USB ports are, like, inside there, which is kind of interesting. Kind of hard to see, almost. But, uh, should keep them clean and everything. Uh, obviously the console just looks fucking cool. There's that, uh, that line of, uh, color, you know? Or what is it called? I don't know. I think it's usually blue, which is pretty cool. Anyways, on the back we got plug-in, which is the same plug-in as the uh, uh, PS3's outlet, which is cool. There is the optical out, uh, optical audio, HDMI, uh, Ethernet, and uh, 
Auxiliary, which uh, I'm not really sure what that is. Maybe it's the PlayStation I, but uh, I'm not totally sure about that. Um, has like some boxes, vents and everything, vents all over. So pretty cool. Yeah, it looks pretty fucking snazzy. Hmm. Pretty fucking interesting. Although one thing, you know, as you can see, it only has HDMI. That kind of sucks for people that have older TVs. Um, but, uh, you know, you got to deal with it, I guess. Um, and also, I don't know if you can record right out of the box, which is interesting. Goose? What the fuck are you doing over there? <laughs> but yeah, pretty cool. Um, so let's get out, or let's get into what else is inside the box. Because, uh, of course, you got to have a plug-in cable. Like I said, it's the same thing as a PS3. There is the headset, which is, uh, I mean, it's cool that it g they give it to you, but, uh, it is, uh, <laughs> not exactly the best, uh, headset out there. Then you get two more cables. Uh, this one is to charge your controller. Um, it looks about the same size as the PS3's charger, uh, cable. Um, and I think it is the same input, or the same plug-in. Anyways, uh, it's not very long, which kind of sucks, but, uh, you know, you can find longer ones online, so just do that. Also, it comes as an HDMI cable, looks about six feet, I would say, which isn't crazy, but uh, isn't that as, I mean, they give you an HDMI cable. I know a lot of consoles in the past, they didn't even give you an HDMI cable, so uh, that's really nice. So, anyways, to wrap it up, that's pretty much it. The console, again, looks beautiful. It, uh, there's the back of it, I guess I never showed it, but, uh, there isn't a whole lot to it on the back. Um, and it looks like, I mean, the, the bottom of the console is flat, so it probably would stand up. But, as you saw on the front of the box, uh, they do have a stand for, I guess, better, uh, better stability and everything. So, uh, there it is. Pretty fucking cool. There you see me right there. Fuck yeah. I'm so cool. <laughs> Not really. Um, anyways, so yeah, there's a PS4. Fucking awesome. There's my face on the PS4. Fucking awesome. There's Mavi. Fucking awesome. There's Goosey. Fucking awesome. Fucking, 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 fucking cool shit. <laughs> if you guys remember how many times I said fucking in this video, put it in the comments. Pretty cool stuff. HDMI cable, plug in for the controller. Uh, power cable, other cool stuff. Controller, pretty cool stuff. So thanks for stopping by and checking out this beastly video. If you guys want to drop a like on it, be sure to do it. But I'll see you crazy motherfuckers around the bend. Peace out.